Hello everyone! In this video, we will be taking a look at events. So, to get started, we are going to read this interactive story on elementary. The link to it is in the description of the video below. And let's just get started. There's a voiceover, so we're going to listen to the voiceover. And I'll provide any comments as I think is necessary. What is an event? Basic coding concepts. Click on watch the video to be redirected to the YouTube video or click on get started to learn about events. So let's get started. What is an event? An event tells the computer when to run the code or program. Click on next to learn more. Okay, so an event tells the computer when it's going to execute a piece of code or instructions. So what does code or program mean? Computer code or computer program are just instructions you tell the computer to do. Let's take a look at some examples to see it in action. Okay, let's go ahead and see examples. Do you hear that music? When did the music start? Okay, so we have a couple of choices on page start, on click, or on magic. If you try on magic, it's not quite the right answer. So let's try again. Do you hear that music? When did the music start? So the music started when the page started. Now, when does the bunny bounce? So the bunny's glowing. Let's try to click on it. Click. 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 Okay, so I think it's on click. Do you see the glowing images? The blue glowing effect lets readers know that they can interact with the object, either by clicking on it or dragging it around. Try to click on each of the wolves. Can you figure out what the difference is between the two events? Okay, so let's try clicking on the big wolf first. I'm going to click on him now. He seems to howl when I click on him. I'm going to try clicking on him again. Okay, and he howls again. So now let's try clicking on the small wolf. What are you howling at? Oh, he's not glowing anymore, and I can't click on him anymore. But I can still click on the big wolf. So, what's the difference between the two? Let's take a look. Well, you can only click on the small wolf one time but you can click on the big wolf as many times as you want, and he'll always howl. Let's now review events on elementary. Events on elementary are orange blocks. Here are the events we looked at. On page start, on click, and on click once. Click on continue to go to the next page. Okay, so on click once was used to play the music. So when does the music play? The music plays when the page starts. And we saw the click events on the bunny as well as the wolves. So remember for one wolf, he howled every single time you clicked on him. 
so we used this block on click. But for the small wolf, you were only allowed to click on him one time. So that is on click once. Okay, so let's continue. So what's next? We now know that events tell the computer when to run code. However, we need to tell the computer what to do. Click on learn about functions to learn about how we can use functions to tell the computer what action to do. And that's it for events. So you can click on learn about functions. The link to that video will be somewhere above or down in the description. And I'll see you in the next video about functions that tell the computer what action to do.